Hey guys, this is a short little video. Um, I was watching Wayne over at Wayne's World Garage. They were trying to make uh, tomato steaks and using the point. And he was having an issue with his steak, steak maker. <clears throat> so this is what I had to do with mine. Uh, the... The blade closest to the drill is all the way back against the set screws and the shim is in there all right and if you stick your finger down in there you can just barely feel the blade now on the other one the one closest to the, to the uh, the throat here I had to take the shim out because it wasn't sitting far enough down uh, to cut through some of those knots and stuff and this is also there is a 16th inch gap that you can see down between the screw and the the blade I don't know if that picks it up on camera I can't really tell on the screen on my camera um, but take the shim out and then stick a 16th drill bit down in there and then tighten it down and then you should be good to go <clears throat> you're also going to want a drill with this setting here you're going to burn your drill up pretty quick uh, I, I went through two drills uh, one was a 30 year old drill that I got from my grandfather um, and they don't make drills like they used to that thing lasted a long time um, and then eventually with this this tool here it just burnt burned it up and then I went out and bought a new drill um, comparable to what I had uh, from my grandfather and that one literally caught fire after the third stake so you're going to want to get the recommended drill if you're going to be making a lot of those uh this is the um i have a video on it you can look back uh through my videos it's the bosch it's the bosch drill um i also have a short on it also but yeah that's what you're going to want to do and how how you um adjust these steak sharpening uh, tools um, the other thing is this will do a full two inch um, uh, uh, stake so even if your mill is cutting fat on one side you should be you should be fine um, I cut all mine inch and a half by inch and a half um, and sometimes the one end is like inch and three quarters and the other end is sometimes maybe two inches. Um, if you do get a wide uh, board, what I what I do is, well, let's just say this is, the sticker here is a stake. I will take a razor blade and I'll just trim off just uh, a couple shavings off of the, the two corners. And this way it fits in the but yeah <clears throat> i hope that helps you out wayne try with you later bye